Damn, baby. Inside the Ohio um, town invaded by cat eating Haitians. So we're about to. Don't wait with me, you sorry. This is about Sam. There was Haitians in a white van driving around the neighborhoods collecting cats, skinning them and eating them. In my opinion, they're worthless. A bunch of worthless f***ing saints. They're getting thousands of dollars in government assistance. Even the cash assistance cards. They're calling them the magic money cards because they never run out. Uh, man, they're nothing but a headache. All they're doing is raising our rent and our taxes and, and wrecking vehicles. Everybody wants to make this into a race issue. It's not a race issue. It's, it's culture, it's accountability, and it's respect. Since June, they took me off of my vet. They took me off of the disability. So one thing real quick, I'm from Columbus, Ohio. So we're like 45 minutes away from this city, apparently. It's called Springfield. I've been to Springfield plenty of times. You have to go through Springfield to get to places like Dayton or Cincinnati or uh, Kentucky, or if you want to go to the Hooters, you know, downtown Cincinnati on the other side of the bridge, you know, you got to pass Springfield. For the, you're a veteran, and know. you're competing with some of the resources they're getting and just came in here? Yeah. I need some solutions. I'm losing my mind. This is Springfield, Ohio. What was once a small town in Ohio, home to roughly 60,000 working-class Americans, until 20,000-plus Haitian immigrants flooded into town with rumors of them eating the neighbor's cats and local geese. What did you do? Why did you kill the cat? Did you eat that cat? Did you eat it? How would you kill it? They're eating the dogs, the people that came in. They're eating the cats. They're eating, they're eating the pets. And causing car accidents left and right, and driving locals out of their homes by paying above market rental prices with welfare subsidized by the American taxpayer. Are these Haitians eating cats? How did they travel 2,000 plus miles from Haiti all the way to Ohio? And do the locals and their new Haitian neighbors get along? I pulled up to Springfield myself to see if this was real or overblown fake news. A lot of this is alleged because I truly don't know what's going on, and neither does Twitter. Twitter is relying off of a few images and a few Reddit threads, cool. and there are rumors that Haitians are taking neighbors' cats and eating them. Uh, cool the fact that someone knows about a place like Springfield, Ohio. Like, as a child, that's like a place I go visit, like, my aunts and, like, my mom's, like, besties at, like, you know, like, that's crazy. Are you from Haiti, by chance? Does everyone get along here in Springfield? Yes. Good? Good. Motherfuckers are worthless. Bunch of worthless f***ing sand. Yeah. When did the Haitian neighbors come and move here? I'm going to say probably five months ago. I spoke to a few of them in French. They're everywhere. They're up there. Don't wait at me, you sorry. Excuse me, how, how are you? Not long, I tell them like it is. F***, man. I don't like them. I don't like them, and I, 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 want, I want them to know I don't God, like them. Back up and move back to Hadyville, where the f*** you're from. Why did you come here to Springfield? I'm from Springfield. I'm going to work and I'm going to be better. I'm going to be a Haitian. Okay. Okay. Um, do you plan on living here for much longer? Yeah. Yeah. I heard there were rumors of Haitians eating the neighbor's cats and a Canadian goose. Is that true or completely false? No. 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 Okay. No. 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 Okay. 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 Hey, you don't know no English? That's a, that's a bad sign. I'm just going to say it like that. Like, even the Africans and all that being Columbus and they know English, man. Like, perfect. You, 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 you tweaking if you don't know. Date, you a little too close to dating not to know, though. You, you know what I mean? Uh, we've lost a whole bunch of cats. Uh, there was a van load of, a van pulled over that had over 100 cats in it with the Haitians. They said they was eating them. Actually? Second yeah. cup. Not fake news. Not fake news. So a van was collecting cats and eating them. I watched it happen, yeah. I watched them get pulled over with the cats and admit to the police that they was eating them. You're not joshing with me. No. I'm almost 50 years old, buddy. I don't, no. Nah. You don't mess around. No. Twitter is saying the Haitians are eating cats and can't drive. Is that true? <laughs> <laughs> true or no? No. No? Okay. I believe it. Like, I've heard rumors about them taking the geese and killing them and eating them, so I try to stay clear away because they, I've even heard about them eating the eggs over there, so I'm like, okay, that's kind of disturbing. Really not. There he is. This is your guy right here? Uh, yes. Okay. So far, so good. I haven't had no issues, but they kind of know us. And are they chill? Dogs are better. All right, I guess I don't pay no mind. The messenger, you know, and they're every where they take our fucking apartments. That the landlords make the people move out so they can rent to the Haitians to get more money. You know, it's bullshit. You know, you go to the grocery store. There's no fucking groceries. Just, you know, they give them three thousand dollars a fucking month plus food stamps. I'm an American, yeah. just like you. Yeah. And these motherfuckers come from Haitianville or wherever the fuck 
they're from, and they get everything. They get their, they get medical care paid and everything. You know, it's it's bull. Where do they get the money? The government. Okay. They said it's a fucking uh, program for them to uh, for like migrants, like asylum seekers. Yeah. Asylum, yeah. Okay. I mean, mm -hmm. they're like roaches, man. Yeah, I get along with them as long as they don't go pulling their crazy machetes when they're out mowing their grass with it. Not the crazy machetes. machetes oh though. yeah, they. Yeah. That's how they turn their yard. They actually. Yeah. It surprised me they let them all in, but I think that if they're going to come in, they should be legal and not illegal. And I don't see why they're giving them all this money and everything like that when our people are like suffering for all this for them coming in. I'm getting ready to be homeless. They're getting ready to sell my house because of the Haitians. Maybe if we want to do a tweet. Yeah, Wednesday to look at it. Actually? Yeah. And when they buy this house, we'll both be out here on the streets. We ain't got nowhere to go. We want to fix the income. Are Haitians paying? rent? Are they paying their bills? Are they being paid to live here? They're being paid to live here. I don't see why they'd have to pay rent if they're being paid to be, be here. Who's paying them? The government. And that's that's our biggest issue too is they're taking our schools over and they're running the Americans out of our own countries it feels like. Side note I heard um, Barbecue, Mr. Barbecue is taking over uh, Haiti. Correct me in the comments. Let me know in the comments if that's true. This this country has gone to hell. Well, mother live there and there's another seven or eight lives right there here in this go. corner house and, it, door, yeah. and four of them just moved in here they ain't in there do you think you'll sell the house to a haitian family one day hell no i wouldn't give them mother <laughs> the sweat off my balls if he's dying of thirst <laughs> whoa i'm, I'm for real man i, I am it. i am we know, this dude. Is, you know i don't give a, they put a haitian <clears> house. Throat> throat> i'll be the only white person here uh twitter is saying oh, that man, we know what are all, man. kidnapping the neighbor's cats and eating them <laughs> Is that true or false? I, I gotta ask the hard questions here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay. Why is everyone coming here? I sent you here for to avoid me manger chat. No, because we don't pas manger chat. No chat. No. Si nous besoin viande, manger viande, aller dans Walmart, non acheter, mais manger chat haïtien, pas manger chat. OK. Why did you leave Haiti? Moi t'ai quitté Haïti parce que dans mon pays, tu ont des gens qui ont des problèmes politiques, des gens de ce qui a passé, ça des juste essayer. I was looking for barbecue, okay, where you at? Ça arrangé pour moi retourner dans le pays. Barbecue? Civil war? Like. Moi pas connait aucun rien de monde seulement j'ai un problème mais c'est Déplacé, même pas qu'on est en qu'un nom de la personne qui a fait ça. Ok. Ok, so just family and friends told him to come here to Springfield? Tight, Could you ask him that? Yeah, he's free. See, Buddy was avoiding a question. I don't care what nobody said. He avoided that. Barbecue got tabs on, bro. He's gonna find you, bro. I see. Okay. Merci. Okay. okay. I don't need cat. <laughs> okay. She clarified, I don't need cat. See how that trash can is right there? Right there. Yep. Okay. Every Haitian house you go around, it's honestly filled to the brim. There's trash that leaks out onto the corner. It's like beer trash everywhere. Can. <laughs> trash can's on the side. Clean environment. Cool. And then on top of that, with the rise of immigrants and they get assisted living freely, it makes it harder for people like me. Yeah, skip else. Ahead. Come on. Haitians. Okay, pero yo vive por mi padre, y me entro al cada mes, y de ciento. Is anyone eating cats? 700, it's not too no. bad, buddy, okay. but that's some also, Springfield shit. Also, you also important. Have cheaper okay. rent Do you know many other Haitians here? Yes. Smaller yeah. cities in Ohio. Big community? Right, yes, yes. 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 Okay. Yeah. You have and a Walmart? Why are so many Haitians coming here to Springfield in particular? Up to life, I'm going to go to Springfield. It's because I'm going to go to Springfield. I'm going to go to Springfield. It's going to permit me to go to Springfield. Okay. Yeah, Amazon uh, and Walmart is hard. So, if you want to support our boots on the ground, independent journalism, get that yearly that's check from one of my hobbies, from interest, Amazon or Walmart, hard, early well, access no matter to all my videos what happens in my life, YouTube I can work for that. Exclusive and I'm, DLC I'm content same. that YouTube won't let me upload. Go subscribe to patreon.com slash Tyler. Ah, okay. Merci beaucoup. All right, bye bye. We got a cat right there, unaffected. He's chilling. Not eating. It's ridiculous. They yeah, can't man, even take care of the man. American citizens before they're bringing in waves and waves of immigrants. And then look at it. There's so many people, veterans, uh, mostly. I mean, what do you guys think about that in the comments? Are we giving too much money to immigrants or are we like cool with that? Or are y'all cool with that? Let me know in the comments, man. White people yeah. that are homeless, living on the streets, has nothing to eat. But these people have brand new houses, brand new cars. I'm having I mean, a hell of a time finding a job because. I seen an immigrant in a Hellcat the other day. 
You know what I'm saying? He threw a 20 at me in the face. I was tripping. Nah, nah, I'm just kidding. They want the Haitian. They're getting thousands of dollars in government assistance. I worked retail before I lost my job back in April. When I do transactions, I can see what comes across on certain cards. I'm not trying to be nosy. I don't want to know what you get. But when a Haitian comes through and spends $500 in food stamps and still has five grand on their food assistance card. Five grand? Five grand. Would you like to know what the Haitians are calling the food assistance cards? Tell me. Even the cash assistance cards. They're calling them the magic money cards because they never run out. I'm homeless. I'm jobless. I'm sleeping on friends' couches because I can't get government assistance because I come from the wrong country, apparently. Y'all get along out here or what? We don't socialize with them that much. I mean, they walk up and down the street, they do their one little thing. That's it, you know. We yeah. keep I know somebody here is scamming off of that. I don't oh, know who. I know somebody. I'm six six down churches, bro. When did all the Haitians come in? About five years ago, maybe. Okay. And when they packed, they hit this neighborhood hard. Why? Outrageous rent. They went through, they painted them, cleaned them up a little bit, rent them to them, and they pay the rent. I heard on Twitter that cats are getting kidnapped. Is that, that yes, true? Yes, my mom You're actually. Laughing. Seen, my mom actually seen, seen a post on Facebook. There was. Yo, if you're from Springfield and your cat has been stolen from the Haitians, drop it in the comments. We're going to help you find your cat. Cat Connects. Cat Hunters. I think of a better name, but yeah. ...in a white van, driving around the neighborhoods, collecting cats. What? Skinning them and eating them. Snyder Park, our actual park. If a Haitian is caught walking the grounds down there, they can get arrested because they're going down there and they're killing the Canadian geese so they can take them home and eat them. I wouldn't be surprised if, because we used to have a lot of cats around here. And especially down here at the end That's of the... That's why my allergies be tripping in Springfield. Now she's like they have five. And uh, the geese down the park, they're declining, so I don't know if they're eating them too. I guess it's supposed to be their natural habitat or something, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Do my. you think this could come to another American town near you? This could come everywhere, man. Yeah, it's the future of America. I hate to say it, but probably so. The Mexicans take it up from the blacks, and the blacks taking it up from the Mexicans is odd. Interesting. My country's going out. Yeah, I can't wait till Trump gets back in. 90% oh, of the auto accidents are patient involved. And I've almost got hit by some level of the road because I've walked a lot and they're going the wrong way down one way streets like, and they think they own the streets. And when they got chased out, he hit the curb. When they got chased out, she heard one of them say it and it was actually in English. And it was blasted off. What the fuck? They've knocked down my my grandmother's fence. Yeah. That brick wall back there, they've drove into it. They've hit hard around here. I mean, they cannot drive. Whoever's giving them driver's license, I don't have theirs taking them. But look, they every time right some, a yeah, country yeah, moves yeah, into another country yeah. talk about we're taking look, over, that should bleeds the war. 100%. Like, when you have the old they're black dudes siding with the old white redneck, yeah. and they're talking yeah. about joining teams, that's when you know everything is going to go downhill, and it's going to go downhill quick. Real, we all know about about the uh, about the neo Nazis just a couple weeks ago being down down. Oh, and, uh, I ain't saying that's right, and I ain't saying it's wrong. But look, let's think about it. I'm 36 years old, and in 36 years, that's the first time I've ever seen the neo Nazis rally in our in our city. My, My mom was coming like... home the other night and seen a carload oh. of clan members. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Members. Yes. Oh, there's full on war. Going down Don't right. start that That's stuff with the love you go. I'm trying to tell you. And it's all going to be against the same time, people. Like Yo quiero hablar conmigo sobre uh, uh, migración so well, de so muchas uh, Haitians a uh, Springfield. Si ¿Sí posible? Si. Sí. ¿De dónde eres? Haití. Haití. Okay. ¿Cuántos meses vive aquí? Mm, un mes. Uh, ¿Qué es la razón uh, que vive aquí? No, yo no me importa. Okay. Yo tengo sobrino que vive ahí. No me importa. Uh, Visitan, ¿cuántos dólares tú recibes a uh, cada mes del gobierno? No, no la vida, porque yo tengo el proceso. Si, so trying to get that bag, I stayed a little glitch a couple years ago. Nada. ¿Cómo es Bay posible que vive en EDD. las casas con them. nada de dinero? Sí, es un visiteo, va con ellos. No, 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 Okay, ¿Por qué maneja el coche con mucho rápido? No fui yo, si estaba con mucho rápido. Mucho rápido, en esa street. Pues. No estaba ni en mi primo. Ah, ok. ¿Es, ¿Es cierto que personas en las casas o no? No lo sé. No, ok, lo siento. Uh, gracias por tu tiempo. I'm trying to interview locals out here and hear their thoughts about the Haitians that have moved in. Yeah, no, I don't, I don't know. I might, I, 
I lived here for 24 years. Yep. I lived in LA for 38 years. Got it. Um, it is causing probably some problems. Uh, I personally noticed it because it took me months on end to find an apartment to live in. Sure. The available housing supply has gone down and the prices have gone up or what? Uh, I'm not 100% sure about the prices going up. I mean, I hear rumors that there's landlords ripping off some of the sure. Haitian people, you know, like trying to put multiple families in a house and charging them too much money. I don't know if that's true. It's just stuff I've heard. But yeah, it has affected the, the market because, you know, like I said, I couldn't even get anybody to call me back for months. Couldn't tell you. I haven't had any problems with anybody. I can tell you that. Again, no cat eating. How do you know, sir? <laughs> What's your name? Levon. Levon. Oh, you own this? Yeah. <laughs> You'd be a great person to talk to, though. Yeah, for sure. We've heard a lot of uh, the Haitians that have moved here recently come here often. Yeah. What's wow. going on here in Springfield? Uh, they're just like an influx of the population in the Haitian community. I mean, they're protected status here, so they're right. just like, I mean, obviously I've filled up the town with it, and 